Ryan has got style. Hi. Hi. How are you? You want to wear this? Oh, what's better on you? And he's got game. Oh! Hey, it's Fat Tony. Welcome to Thrift Hall. A competitive fashion show where two contestants compete to see who can style it the best on a budget. Today's episode, cosplay. Our contestants will be dressing as their favorite fictional character for Comic-Con. Whatever they pick from the Goodwill stuff in California today, they must wear to Comic-Con. Oh, no. But we're going to Comic-Con. That's on camera, right? Contestant number one, artist and musician, Nick Thorburn. Contestant number two, weirdo, Ron Katner. Weirdo? Do that again. That's what you told me to call you? Yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll take it, I'll take it. Can you tell us a little bit about how you guys know each other? Sure, we have a band together called Mr. Heavenly. We've known each other for over a decade. Are you all big on thrifting? I'm into it. Yeah. I'm into furries, too. Oh, this is a perfect yeah. episode for you. Yeah. Contestants will go head to head in three rounds, a physical challenge, competitive shopping spree, and a fashion show. Today, we got guest judge Callion Fox to help figure this whole shit out. Mr. Callion Fox, what is cosplay? So like with cosplay, a lot of people like to dress up as their favorite characters. A lot of people do it specifically for anime. Speaking of anime, I've got a show called Anime Fit 9000. I work out, I get healthy, I get strong and muscular. You should watch it. He is very charismatic. I don't know if the camera's got that. But that's not all. The winner picks out a shitty outfit for the loser to wear and post on their Instagram, and they can never delete it. How do I feel about that shit? Not good. Unrelated. I know he's a judge, but I, this guy's awesome. Oh, thank you. <laughs> he's trying to win me over. Oh. Wait a second. You no, not, I'm judge. not buttering the judge. Each of you begins a competitive shopping spree with two minutes on the clock. But if you want a little more time, I got a physical challenge for you. You down? Let's do Let's it. Let's do it. Physical challenge. You gotta look like Sailor Moon. We got three items for you to make it happen. Hair tie, ribbon, and face paint. Do we pick one of the three? Gotta use them all. Oh, shit. I'll do the two minutes, that's cool. <laughs> Get them to shit. Ready, set, go! Oh wait, there's a timer on this? Yeah, you got 30 seconds. Oh wait, you can just do one, I'll figure out the other one. Oh, I got it. I love the ribbons. I'm already regretting this. Here, do you want like uh, red cheeks? Yeah, give me some red cheeks. Okay. That seems painful. 20 seconds! You guys look terrible. <laughs> Yeah, this isn't really working. Great. Here, lipstick? Great. Yeah. Three, two, one. Wait, was this a challenge against each other? Yeah, y'all are going head to head. Oh, head so we just help? That's all right, that's fine. Kelly on, what do you think? Oh my God. We got one Sailor Moon versus the other. Who did it best? <laughs> all right, I just have to say, Nick looks adorable with the blush, but the pigtails won me over. I'm gonna have to give it to Ryan, man, I'm sorry. I won because of Nick's help, so I, I don't mind giving him my time. How much extra time do I get? So you get 30 seconds. Can I give him 15? This never happened before, but okay, why not? So you each got two minutes and 15 seconds on your clock to shop for your cosplay outfit. Ryan, since you won this portion, you get to choose who goes first. It's only fair that the best man should go first. All right. Uh, Can I wash this with my face, or do I have to do it with... Ah. Round two, shopping spree. I need to win for a lot of reasons, but mostly because I'm in a little bit of a legal situation, some financial s debts. I know Ryan well, I play music with him, I know him intimately, and I know how to uh, use my kindness as a smokescreen against him. We got Nick up first, check it out. You're gonna be judged on your creativity, your overall look, and your adherence to the theme, which is cosplay, we're going to Comic-Con. You got two minutes and 15 seconds, are you ready? It's born ready. One. Two, and a three, y'all. Start slow, I like to start slow. Take your time with it, bro. All right, I like this. Ooh! Whoa. This looks pretty good. Fuzzy. I'm gonna just drop this on the head right now. Fuzz. Take this Damn, too. just a few seconds in, he already killing the game. Oh, Whoa. man, oh, how did you God. do Whoa! Okay, okay. Untangle it. Oh, he's got some blue. Oh, gotta get a blue. You got two minutes. Uh, he bounced the blue in the black box. Oh! Oh! Shoes. Penguin sweater. Oh. Oh, my God. See this shit? Yeah, it's garbage. Bro. Wow. wow. But Nick listen. Style. Nick? He's got style, bro. He's got Nick style. Big style. Don't get distracted. Oh, he's going for you all got the, a minute he's 30. Going for all the stuff I was gonna grab. Excellent. That's some Jackie O, alright? Jackie O. Excellent. <laughs> Great pick. Little Michael Hutchinson belt. All right, see, what I like about Nick's approach is he's, he's real calculated with it. He's, he's it. taking his time. He just grab <laughs> all willy-nilly. I like that a lot. Oh, I like this. You bastard. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of fire. Yeah, that's what I was gonna grab. That's not cool. That's we got one minute left. One minute. One minute, uh-oh. OK. 
Okay, he's 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 in the whites. Got out the basics. Oh, I'm talking about. Okay, he's spinning. Oh my god, he's spinning. Okay, I gotta rethink my whole strategy now. Oh, shouldn't have let me go first. Little green. Is it a top Ooh. or is it a bottom? Oh, those look good on his legs. All right, now I'm panicking. Five seconds. Five seconds. Four. Three. Two. One. Oh no. I think I broke this. It's yours, you bought it. You just saw Nick do his thing, your thoughts? Whole lot of skirt. If rumors are true, I did get a few skirts. I figured I'm going for this P-Monster Z or whatever it is, so I gotta pick some green to match. Another skirt. He had a very specific technique going on that I really appreciated. You know, he got the Gurr hat from Invader Zim. I'm a very huge fan of Invader Zim, so I don't know, he might have you with that one. Yeah, he kind of f***s you from the start. He did kind of f*** me from the start. Some shoes, belt, the blue blouse. I really like the different type of colors he had going. You know, he had like a pink he got, top. He got a little bit of everything. In the heat of the moment, I did grab some child-sized pants, not be wearing those. And then I got this nice little power suit. Oh, and these white pants. And then a sun hat to complete the look. I like how you took off your glasses like David Caruso, though. That was cool. You can kiss all the ass you want, it ain't gonna work. Stay focused, just guide me. We got this one, little Nick. Ryan, you ready? Uh-huh. Gonna count you down. Three, two, one. Glad the gate. Oh. Wow. Two minutes and 15 it. seconds, what you got? All right, he's got a plant, okay. Going weird yeah. with it. Okay. Oh. Oh, I like that pick, bro. Oh, this heavy. Oh, <laughs> Ryan's got style. All right, all right, all right, all right. What else you got? Nick went with color, so I'm trying to go a little more. Okay, he got the antlers, okay. That's yes, unique. Man. That's different. How much time do I have? A minute 30, what's up? Okay, okay. Don't let the other customers distract you. Hi. You like that? Probably won't fit. F it. Hey, he's he's uh -oh. definitely got something going okay. on okay. with his style. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Uh. Okay, a little fall. It took a tumble. He's good. He's good. Hey, gotta have the carpets and the matching belts. Fifty seconds. Match that carpet with your belt, bro. All right. Okay, okay. Oh, Ryan. I just need bath mats. Gotta have the bath mats, bro. Yes. He passed on it. Put it in the cart, bro. 20 seconds. Ryan has got style. Oh. Hi. Hi. How are you? Do you wanna wear this? Oh, what's better on you? I think he could fit you. Oh. And he's got game. Five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Five, four, three. Pressure. Two. Pressure. One. Pressure. Ah. I, I grabbed all brown. I saw this and I was like, ah, this is central to my theme. A very different approach than how Nick went about it. He just went straight into it, just started grabbing a whole bunch of things. You know, the more options, the merrier. I like the plan. The plan was awesome. It'll make sense, trust me. He got me with the bathroom mats and the matching ties. He got quite a few. A lot of rugs, bath mats. I'm just curious to see what he's gonna do with it. Does he lose points if he doesn't wear it? Maybe cool points. As they were commenting, I got a lot of bath mats. Always need belts, right? Skirt, a hat. Oh, a flash of pink, some color. This, <sighs> and a lot of other stuff. Get ready for round three, Nick. You might as well leave, right, little Nick? Right. Oh man, little Nick is shedding. <laughs> Asbestos, probably. Ugh. The runway. Remember, guys, we're judging on creativity. Your look and adherence to the theme, and the theme is cosplay, baby. Ryan, bring your ass out here. I'm trying. All right, here I'm coming. All right. Oh. Hello. No way. Are you serious? Uh, can you tell us a bit about your character for Comic-Con? <laughs> the belt. When you said cosplay, which was my worst nightmare. Okay. Initially, I was just going to put on a ton of shit and just be like Howl's Moving Castle. But instead, I'm that deer creature from Princess Mononoke. So, I'm a deer creature. Yes, the Shishigami. Yeah, there you go. The thing that I had to kind of think on my feet about was that uh, I had this jacket that was gonna serve as my core piece. Mm -hmm. Nick saw me hide it, so he busted me for cheating on that. So I kind of had to improvise with this white vest. An honest man, I love that. Once I saw this, I was like, I can work with this. So that's why I grabbed all brown, not thinking that it's really hot. That's okay. 
It's fashion. Yeah, yeah. I gotta say, I'm very impressed that you were able to make use of the deer, the plant, and the bath mats. I ain't never seen no shit like this in my life. And I, I used all the skirts to like uh, pad out these. The good thing about this outfit is it's very psychedelic. Like I'm really starting to trip from all the heat. <laughs> Oh, he's really sweating. Yeah, I, I'm. <laughs> this is crazy. I'm sorry. I'm very impressed. Highly impressed. Because this is one of my favorite movies. He's got the the magical antlers using the plant like off of the movie. And I think there's like a tie in there somewhere. Oh, it's a tie. It ties it all together, man. Some good. Sh Ryan Katner, thank you very much. I forgot something. This was like a symbol of like brotherly love between Nick and myself. Because I honestly don't care who wins this thing. When I was out there grabbing stuff, I decided that my little Nick needed to have like a little Nick jacket. Just like Big Nick. So it's like little Big Nick. Wow. So this is for you, Nick. Hey, you didn't have to stunt like that, bro. No, it's for real. Wow, well, Ryan really shut shit down. Uh, let's see what Nick's got. Oh, hey. Ooh. What's up? I don't know. I don't know what I am. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell us a little about your outfit? I think I'm like a cartoon grunge guy. Cartoon grunge guy. I'm a frog or something. <laughs> I don't know anime. I mean, you definitely look like an anime fan. All right. What's what you got? <laughs> That's a great start. Uh, you look like you're going to a K-pop concert. I only had two minutes, okay? It was hard. I love the shoes. Can you tell us a little bit about them? I just found them over there. <laughs> okay. I don't know, they look like snow boots or something. Yeah, they're cool, they're futuristic. It's like you're going to a land party or something. Okay. Can you tell us about the belt? No, I found it over there too. It's just a belt. It's colored. Okay. I don't know. Are you layered? You have something under there? Yeah, I'm really hot. I got like two skirts on. There's a green one, a pink. The blouse. Pull that pink back up, bro. Yeah, let me see. Let's see that green. Oh, damn. I knew it was I, something. He's pretty coordinated. You brought, the you brought the flavor with that green, bro. I was trying to match the frog. You got the pink on the dress. You see the pink tongue on the hat. Damn. And so when you lifted that pink up, bro, and I saw the green compliment the hat. Got something going, bro. I won? I, I just, I'm not saying all that, but. Oh, okay. We like your outfit. All right. Kelly on Fox, what do you think? Let's start with Ryan. Crazy imagination. I like Princess Mononoke a lot. Mm -hmm. And I must say, I don't know how he managed to come up with all that within two minutes. Pretty impressive. Yeah. The color coordination behind it all, piecing everything together. The f what did I say in the beginning? Even though we don't know what he's gonna do with it, he's got a vision and I want him to follow his vision. If you have a vision, don't pay attention to what people say about it. If you know what you wanna do, do it. Let's, let's talk about Nick. I mean, off the back when he picked up the Gurr hat, the Gurr is a little dog from a show called Invader Zim that I was just like, wow. Said a lot about him. Nick's got style. Mm. The green skirt under the pink skirt. He was so modest about it. Yeah. He almost didn't reveal it. Is it gonna be Ryan? Is it gonna be Nick? <sighs> let's bring him out. Ryan, Nick, to the runway. Guys, y'all both did your damn thing. Really lived up to the theme of today's episode, which I love. I can't thank you enough. But Kelly on and I have decided on one winner, Comic-Con. Who's gonna turn the most heads? Is it gonna be Ryan? Is it gonna be Nick? <sighs> you know, after thinking about it for the past 47 seconds, I'm gonna have to give it to Ryan. It's gonna be Ryan. Oh, oh, oh. oh I feel so beautiful. Thank you, thank you. Nick, don't cry. It's cool. You can still go to Comic-Con. Nick, don't forget. You've got style. Don't ever forget that, Nick. I literally am choked up because I can't breathe. Ryan, we're going to need you to pick out an outfit for Nick for his Instagram. I'll be kind. I'll be kind. Hey, Nick, I got you something to match your little Nick. My little Nick. Oh. And then here's like a little Nick outfit. Oh. Here we go. We're all winners here at Thrift Hall. Ryan, gonna need you to take a pic of Nick for his Instagram. Sure. Nick, remember the rules. You can't delete it. Work it, Nick. I tried to manipulate Ryan, and I underestimated him, and I got played. I didn't see that coming. Ryan Katner, the game is yours. Yeah! Big shout out to Callie and Fox, Nick and Ryan for rocking with us today. Comment below on what you think the next episode should be about. The singularity, favorite literary character, millennial Republican, or podcaster? Changed my mind about the makeup. I wish I left it on. So flattering. I'm a natural beauty. I don't need makeup. <laughs>